Lost track of how many blisters I got. That's gross. Hey everyone, welcome back to my castle build. I'm outside the castle right now and I just relocated my Brahmin outside of the castle. I'm going to be working inside today and I didn't really want to hear them breathing the whole time right behind me. Because today I want to build my bar and grill over here. And it would be really cool if I could put some kind of sitting area out here too. I don't know, we'll just have to see what I can do. But before I do that, I want to just show you what I have done as far as the walls and my towers. So, I'll get out of the build mode for now. And, oh, it's horrible weather. So let me fix that real quick. Okay. Here are what my towers look like. Pretty cool. I worked hard on these. It took me hours to get these things built up because I wanted them to be two stories, each of them, so that they would all look pretty much the same when you're looking at it. It looks so cool. I like how that turned out. So just to give you an idea of what I've done, two of them here, this one here and the one catty corner that direction facing more of the ocean, I turned into more guard areas. And inside we have the guard barracks. I haven't wired anything yet. I don't have power to anything. And I don't have it fully decorated, but I started on it. So this is one of the barracks and bathroom. It's kind of cool. So you have some private stalls in here. Then you shower together and you bath together pretty much. The other one looks almost exactly like this one, so I'm not going to show you both. Then what I did was, I believe this one here, I'll have to get down <clears throat> so I can get inside here, inside the wall, but I'll show you that. So, go here, get inside, run back over here. Okay, so this is going to be where I have the prisoners. I have some shackles on the walls. And then I also have, you can't see them when you're outside of build mode, I have some place markers here for a guard to be standing guard and for some prisoners to be doing their idle animations. So that's what this one is. And then down here... Um, I'm not sure exactly what I want to do with this part. Um, but upstairs, I turned it into sort of like storage. So here we have a bunch of their power armor with their Minutemen insignia on there. And storage. So I'm thinking down here I may just do the same thing. I didn't really want to close this off, but I may end up closing it off anyways. I don't know. With this entrance here, up into this, it's kind of, kind of, it'll be kind of tricky to make it work because this is such a narrow area to walk through here if that were closed. So I don't know. I might leave that open. And if you have any ideas of what I could put right below the storage area, let me know. And then, so we'll skip this one because this is the other dormitory and bathroom area. And then over here we have the blacksmith area. So I left it open and it's two story when you get in here. But it was really cool because from the top you can get into it from out here. And I thought it was really neat to have kind of an overlook area here. So I made it this way. I don't have it fully decorated, but I did put a few of the workstations out. So that looks pretty cool too. Then Back over here, we're back where we were. Okay? So that's what I've done so far. It looks pretty cool. I like it. I'm not sure either what I want to do with all these corridors. I don't want to close it off. 
I like that you can go through everything, so I don't know if I'll just leave it walkways or if I might put some things in here. This area right here is going to be for more guards. I just need to put some guard stations out, but I'll do that eventually. But yeah, that's what I've been working on. It's taken hours and hours and hours to get all of this done. But it was fun, and I think it'll be worth it in the end. This castle will look pretty cool. So, let's get started down here on the build. I want to build in underneath here to turn this into our little bar and grill. So I'm going to jump into my build mode and I'll be right back. One of my subscribers gave me an idea to name the bar and grill hole in the wall bar and grill. So I think I'll go with that. I like that idea. That's pretty cool. So I need to decide how I want to build this and what I want to build it out of. I think it would be nice to have something different because we've got castle wall there and of course castle wall surrounding us. So maybe we could do something with the wood. Um, I haven't really thought about this too much, how I want to build it. So let me look at these pieces. I know that I love the shack walls in Snap and Build. And they have metal, which might look pretty cool. We could go with these. Or we could do something like the wood. I also love the wood. That looks really cool too. It's kind of hard to tell. There we go. So we could do something like that. Um, of course, here's the roofs that go with the set and the doorways. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna go with wood for this one. I think I'd like to try something in the middle. That might look pretty cool. And we could do it with high ceilings. I wouldn't- I don't think I'd necessarily want to do two floors for people to walk around on. I doubt that it would even fit. But we could build two stories, most likely have like a big open ceiling in there. So I need to start by figuring out what I want for floors. And to do that I think I'll go up to USO in my structures because this is it moves all of your vanilla pieces. So what kind of floor? That's another question. We could just do the plain old wood floor, which I think would probably be just fine. And my next thing is, where do I want to put them? I guess I would have to build inside. Or do we just build around these things? Oh wow, that's, that's the question. Alright, let me turn surface snapping off. And I want to see... Like, if I lined that one up, sort of, with this, and let's do this. I just want to see if I can get it to where it'll snap through everything and see what it looks like. That's almost pretty even. With that. So let's see. My floor is going to disappear back here because of this rubble. And I don't even know if I'll be able to really build anything back here because of that. So let's just keep going. Let's snap a piece here maybe. Just put one there. And I have to leave room for people to be able to walk through here too. So I can't put my building all the way out there even though I might want to. So this might be a really small bar, bar and grill in here. We could get away with that. I might just put the floor here anyway and build my wall of my building kind of into this a little bit in the back here. So if I do that, we've got enough room for people to walk this way. I could probably actually fix it. Let's see, where's the shorter pieces? I think for this side over here, I'm going to go with these little smaller pieces. And 
I'll have to make shorter walls on this side, but I don't want to close this off all the way. I want people to be able to walk through here without getting stuck. So I think that's a good sized building, especially if I'm going to have some kind of sitting area, hopefully out here. All right, so let's go back out of USO and go back to Snappy. Or snap and build, I guess is what you call it. And I want metal. And I think it would be cool to have the door probably there. So let me start with doors, actually. Uh, get out of this and go to doors. See what we have. How do I work these doors? Oh, there we go. That could work if I don't put glass encloses or enclosures or whatever on both sides. So let me just do that one. And we could probably do glass on this one, but this one won't work with glass because of the thing there. So we could do a solid one this way. And a glass one on that side. That works. And it looks like it's built into the post, which is pretty cool. I like that. Alright, so I'll go back to my walls. And probably do windows, but what kind? Ooh, those are neat. Big windows. Three windows, one. Let's do... I like the look of those. That's kind of cool. But I run into the problem of this side over here not being big enough. Ah, oh, here we go. Look at that. That's what I wanted right there. In my structures, wood, wood walls. I have a mod that gives you half-size walls. And I could have put my door right there if I didn't have this piece, but I like that. That's perfect. It almost matches exactly what I'm doing with the rest of this place. So while I'm at it, I'm just going to go ahead and put the same thing on this end since we know we're running into that problem again. Okay, so now I'll head back to my snappy or snap and build. I always say it wrong. Jack. And I think we'll have another door down here. So let's put in another doorway. And this one we could actually do both with the glass. Did I use this one? Yes. So let's do both. Why not? So we'll have two entrances into the bar and grill, which would be pretty cool. And I'll put the rest of my walls down, but I want to use the same windows. I think it was that one, right? Yeah. So let's do it there. Whoop, don't turn around on me. What are you doing? There. These ones are going to be a little funny looking because they're going into the glass. I almost need one that doesn't have a window right there. But all of these have windows. So... Let me just... I think what I'll do is I'll go back here to my wood walls and stick two of these in. I think that would be better for these spots here. So that my window glass... Here we go. Isn't really looking kind of funny. Why does it take me out of what I was in? Whoop. Like that. Whoa, that's not the window. What? Goodness. There we go. That's the window. Now that one, I might be able to get away with it. Let me just see. Hmm. It runs right into that post right there. Would that look silly? Let's see. Yeah, it kind of does. So I think I'll put that piece back like that right here. Whoops, wrong direction. Woo. Okay. That looks pretty cool. 
And this is a good sized building. So, what about the second floor? These snap, but they snap kind of funny. They snap high. Um, let me go back over to this one and see what happens. Do these snap at all? They do. But, they don't snap where I really think they should, which is weird. So, if that's the case, I don't think I'm going to put another floor on here. Because they're not snapping. <laughs> I don't know where they're trying to snap. It's kind of strange. You'd think they'd snap to the very top of the wall of the one you just built. Whoop. I'll build, put another one up just to see. Oh, I ran out of glass or steel. Yeah, they don't really snap to each other. Okay. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. So we'll just do, I think we're going to have to do a one story. Um, I don't think I want to sit here and try to put these walls on and get them straight. I did enough of that with this castle. I don't want to do that anymore. Oh my gosh, it's so frustrating. So we're just going to switch gears and put a roof on this place. Oh, that's cool. Would that fit? Why is it snapping that way? I want you to I want to see it from the front. What is it doing? And what the heck is it snapping to there? There we go. Would this work? You gotta see up here what it looks like. If it's cutting into stuff too much, I can't use it. Where's it at? Oh, is that it? Well, that's barely anything. I might use that. That looks kind of cool. Probably can't do the same in the middle though because... Right here. Oh, I could. I think. Is it overlapping? No. It fits. Well, that's cool. Now my problem is though, this little extra section. That little extra section there... I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep it. Look at that. That's cool, too. So how do I fill this in? If I use those, are there pieces to fix the roof with on this side that... I'm not going to have trouble. I've never played with this set, so ha, huh, I really don't know. What's that? That's a front left. Front right. No, front left. What? Oh, we just have different kinds. Okay. We've got a middle. Front middle. What? Got the corner. So I don't think most of this is going to work, unfortunately. I can get this snap there. Might get to this get this to work. Let's see. Um where was that piece I wanted in the front? This little guy. Come on. There's a lot of extra snapping points here which makes it kind of hard to get it to go. There we go. Now let's see about the corner piece again. 
get that on. But because this is half sized, it's going to have an overhang outside of it, which is going to look really silly and it's not going to work. So, I think I'm going to have to remove this whole part. If I want to get this wall and, and roof to work a little bit better, I'm not going to be able to use these pieces. Now the problem is, is because this is so small, I can't put that in there, which I really wanted to because I thought it would look cool. But I might be able to get away with it on that other side, possibly. So let's just put this on. So that, whoa, goodness, that covers our front. That looks kind of neat, doesn't it? Now, let's see. Can we put our little gabled window in the middle? I think it was way back here. There we go. Come on. Yeah, that'll work. We'll do one on the other side, too. I really like those things and I wanted to use it, so I'm glad that the side of this bar and grill is bigger. It gives me the opportunity to use these cute little gabled things. Go. And then here I think I've got to go back to those corner pieces again. Way back here. Look at that. Oh, that looks so cool! And it gives you that nice high ceiling that I really wanted in here without having to put double walls in, which is really cool too. Look at that. That's awesome. And up here, you can barely tell. Look, that's all it does up here. I have no trouble getting over it. I don't think any of my garden guys and girls will have trouble with it either. Awesome. That is so cool. Look at that. Neat o. Now, where do you put, where do you get doors from? I guess you just use regular doors. I guess not in Snap and Build, so I could probably just go to USO and put a door in from that. It's getting dark. I'm going to change the time real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, I was going to doors. Single snap. What kind of a door would look cool on here? White door blue green red i like these ones with the little windows in them but i don't know what color the red would probably be fine oh but it doesn't want to snap that direction why why does it only want to snap the one way That's really weird. So if you try to turn it and put it in, it doesn't want to. So it's going to open out. I could just fake it myself and force it to go this way to open. Which I think is probably what I'll do because I kind of want it to open in, not out. It's really hard to tell if you got it straight doing it this way place everywhere. It's wonderful, though. You can get away with it. Yeah. That's great. That'll work. That's what I wanted. I wanted it to open in, not out. Same as... This one actually would probably be better to open out because of how close quarters it is in here. If you open the door, you're gonna get stuck, and I have plans for that, so... Let's put this one opening out. Red door. Here we go. That one opens out. Good. Yes, this is great. That's the perfect size, actually. I didn't need that extra piece. I thought I did, but I really don't. I think that'll work just great. Just like that. <laughs> it looks like, kind of cool there. So, out here... I would like to do some seating. And I might just extend the floor to have kind of its own little sitting area. So I can't really build anything here because of this door. If we ever close it, we're going to kill a lot of people <laughs> if they're sitting there having a drink. All right, so let's get back to... Oh, I was in the right place. I got to go to my wood floors. 
Can see. Oh, I turned. Did I turn? There we go. I don't know why it's not wanting to snap on that side, but I can do it here and then make it snap there. Can I go as far as this? The hat's really close to that thing. Hmm, I don't know. I know I don't want to put another one right there. So I'm probably just going to not have one there. And we gotta make sure we're okay with people walking. We should be fine there. I think that would be enough. We don't need to go crazy with the seating area out here. Are these necessary? Probably. I'm trying to figure out what I like better. I think I'm gonna have to go with those. If I put them all the way across here, then it's almost like one continuous step, which is good. Let's just put one over here. Almost don't need it, do you? But I'll put it there just to keep people from getting stuck, I think. And now I want to put railing around this. I don't want to do the same thing as up there, though. And I was looking in... I think it was in the snap and build. So I'm going to go back there. If it wasn't there, it was... The other one, the uh, snap, snappy builds. It must have been, I don't think this is going to work. I don't think it was in industrial bridges. Nope. Okay. Must have been the other one. Snappy builds. Here we go. Industrial rails. They have some of these cool looking rails. They snap too, which is awesome. Um, but I want to pick what I want to use. These are like yellowy looking. These are darker. And is that all? I think that's it. I think I like the dark ones. And if they have pieces that are short enough like to have one there. Yeah. And then we could do a big one right here. Unfortunately, it snaps in the wrong spot. So I can use place everywhere to push those back. I think I will. So let me do that real quick. I don't want them to be right in the middle of my steps. That's better. So let's do the same with that. I think I'll just do these. These are neat looking. That can look like it's going into there. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. So, then I need some over here, too. I'll just place them. Push them back. That's good. Look at that. We have ourselves a nice little porch and sitting area. outside of our bar and grill. It's hole in the wall. That's pretty cool. So, I need to decorate this baby. But, I think I want to do that. I'll show you what it looks like after the fact. I'm wondering if I should try to cover this a little bit. I wonder what it would look like covered. Or we, I could find some kind of canopy, maybe. I don't know. Hmm. I am not sure how I want to do that, or if I just want to leave it open. So if I wanted to do a little porch on this thing, I don't know. I might not like it with a porch. 
Let's see. Um, I'm going to go back to snap and build the shacks and go to the roof and just see. It would be kind of cool. We could do something where we kind of had, this is just kind of an idea, not really where I'm going to put it right now, but if we did something like that and then put a flat piece behind it. Oh, that snaps right on the wall. Perfect. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I'm stuck on that fence. I can't get over there. Come over here. And then you go... Well, can I get it to snap? Oh, it might be too low. I might have to raise all of this. Yeah. That's not even trying to... I don't want to go where I want to put it. There we go. No. That's not even touching. I thought it was closer than that. All right, let's just get rid of that right now. Will this snap to that at all? Will this snap over here if I turn it? I'm just trying to get a feel for these pieces. I've never messed with them before, so I'm not sure what they're capable of. Let's turn snapping off. I mean surface snapping and object snapping. This would be cool if I could get it high enough. Because as it is right now, can't even get under it. But I like that idea. And I might play with it a little bit to try to get it to work. Is that a smaller piece? No. That's the same size. That has a good angle on it too. Okay. I'm coming up with something. I don't know how it's going to look or how it's going to work. So I'm just going to try to play with it a little bit. See what I can come up with. Alright, that's going to probably be where you can see it in here pretty good, right? No, you can't see it. Okay, now, I mean, this would even work if I could get it to snap. Why does it want to snap so high? That's crazy. So let's go back and find that piece I liked better. It didn't have any ends on it. That one. It's snapping up high and it's snapping further. Is it snapping further back? I don't know. Let's see what happens if I lower it. I might just be able to play with it with place everywhere, get it where I want it to go. Fortunately, these pieces are so big, but I can get up under it, so I think it might be fine if I can get it right where I want it. Now, well, this other piece, it does snap to it. Yes! Just what I wanted. I don't know. I don't know how that would look. Kind of looks neat from the side. Alright, let me see if I can find some kind of a support to stick up under here and see what I think about it supported. Where do I want to go for that? Probably wood or metal. Let's see what's under metal. Got that. That would doll it up a little too much. I think that's just a little too showy. That would work. I just want it to look like it's holding this up. That's pretty good. Let's try another one. Probably can't get it as good as that one. Where did I do it? The end. Oh, 
How far out? I don't know. Whoop. So that one doesn't touch the porch there, but it's okay. Is that how I have it over here? I think. Seems to be. Maybe I can push it in a little bit. Okay. Then I may just go ahead and stick one back here. I'll just leave it that way. So how's that look? I almost feel like I need a support in the middle here too. I think that would probably be smart. Have one just right here. I know it's at the step, but I think people will see it. I want to make sure these aren't coming through. I don't want to be able to see them. That looks good. Okay, now let's look at this thing. I like it like that. I like it better with a porch than I did without. I like those little windows on the roof. That looks really cool. Little skylight looking things. That dolls the front up better. Because it looked a little plain on the front. Because I wasn't able to put these cool little gabled windows in. But I love how that looks. That is so cool. I think that's going to be great. Because it's not even... Like it's attached to the building. It's just its own little sun porch. And that is really cool. I like how that turned out. Yeah, that's perfect. So I'm going to go with that. I think this will be it for the build. I want to work on decorating it. But I think I'll do that between episodes. Because we're running a little bit long. I don't want to go much longer than this on the episode. So that's it. That is the hole in the wall bar and grill. I'll get this all fixed up. It's going to look really cute. I can't wait. This will be really cool. So that is it for today, everybody. I hope that you enjoyed this episode. I had to play with things a little bit and do things without snapping. And it was just a lot of fun. It was a little different. So if you like this episode, please remember to give me a thumbs up. And also remember to subscribe. And I will see you all in my next build video. Bye-bye.